over the pin. Capture of the Japanese HTV cargo craft confirmed at 5.41 a.m. Central Time. The two vehicles are over the southern Indian Ocean uh, at about 220 miles heading down toward the southeast. So once again, the Expedition 26 crew successfully latching on to the Japanese HTV cargo craft. 5.41 a.m. Central Time. Tension is 5,300. Position hold. And Houston Station, it, HTV capture is complete. Great job, you guys, Paolo, Katie, and Scott on the uh, morning's work. Congratulations to all of you, and congratulations to the HTV flight control team. Great work today. Lincoln, we have Crematory in our grasp. It demonstrates what we can do when humans and robots work together. We we'll look forward to bringing HTV2 and Crematory aboard the International Space Station. Good words, Katie. This is Mission Control Houston once again just confirming at 5.41 a.m. Central Time. That is when the Japanese HTV cargo craft was successfully captured using the International Space Station's robotic arm. Of course, that is the uh, first major activity of this morning. The crew is going to use that arm to steer HTV around toward the bottom side of the Earth-facing portion of the Harmony node. This is going to be the home for HTV for the next uh, few weeks, up until February the 18th. That is when HTV will be moved around to the top side of the Harmony node, which is the uh, space-facing portion of it. It'll stay there until after the end of the STS-133 mission, which is going to be Discovery's final flight.